Good morning, people. My name is Kuzai Stanley Murillo. I'm from New York Tech, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set a wiper position on your machine. So the first thing that you need to do right now is to switch on the machine, okay? Now, so you switch on the machine. So by default, uh, the machine starts to initialize, right? So it moves the head from the station position all the way to the top of the machine. And then it goes back to the lifting cap. And then it lifts and caps itself. Now, so um, can you come close the machine this? Now, so this is our, 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 our control panel, right? So, let's assume you want to, uh, to start with the wiper position. So what you do is you press enter, right? Then, I don't know if you guys can see it. Can they see this? Okay. Now you go where it says setup menu. You press enter, okay? And then you go down and locate or look for where it says station setup and then you press enter now we have three options here and more so there's where it says station position spare position and wipe position remember the last time i said pos is just a short for position so you go where it says wipe position okay then you say that you press enter so now on the head the moment you press enter, the head moves itself away from the lifting station, right? So just go down and show them. Underneath here, I don't know if you guys can see this, there is a blue wiper here. There is a blue wiper. This is the one that we want to set. So automatically, the head aligns itself to the last origin or to the last setup position. So when you are setting now, you need to set to where it will uh, align itself lastly. So by the use of your control panel, right, it's either you move your head to the left or to the right, okay? So let's say I move it to the left. Can, you, can they see here? Now, this is, this is our wiper, okay? This is our wiper. So that means if I set here to be okay, that means it's gonna wipe until we want to set. So automatically, the head aligns itself to the last origin or to the last setup position. So when you are setting now, you need to set to where it will uh, align itself lastly. So by the use of your control panel, right, it's either you move your head to the left or to the right, okay? So let's say I move it to the left. Can, you, can they see here? Now, this is, this is our wiper, okay? This is our wiper. So that means if I set here to be okay, that means it's gonna wipe until to this, uh, to this point, okay? So we don't want it to, to come up to this point. We just want it to, to be just after the head okay so that means the wiper is going to wipe up to this to this position okay and then you press enter now come to the control panel so when you press enter on the control panel it says save then you press enter again then it says save done and then after you press exit so now it gives you an option to test the position that you have set then you go down and you say test you press enter so come here so when you do that now it's going to test itself the wiper position that you have set can they see come down here. okay so this is the position that we had marked that it's going to set so it wipes itself all the way from here and it's gonna finish all the way to here as you can see down here, this is our head, okay? So let's assume that you taste it and, and you set it, I mean, to from starting here up to here. That means this will be the last point where our wiper position will be. 
So if we set our Y position up to this level, that means that this is going to be the last point where the wiper will finish wiping the head. Okay. So, and you don't want uh, a, a situation where it's wiping all the way, maybe half to the head, because if it wipes all the way half to the head, that means some of the some of the two channels are not wiping correctly. So make sure you just uh, align it after the head. Okay far after the head or just after the head. I hope it makes sense. Thank you so much.